and welcome entrepreneurs. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your GoDaddy domain directly into WordPress. It's going to be a really easy tutorial. Here's a detailed section of how we can get started. First of all, let's put Chase your domain directly into GoDaddy. If you go into GoDaddy.com, I'm going to leave, of course, the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free and having great deals with buying your first domain. Once you have your actual GoDaddy account, you provide an email, a passcode, and verify that email. And now you have access directly into GoDaddy. So that means that we can just click here, which says type the domain you want. So I'm going to type to express. Hit into search domains and choose the domain which you'd like to purchase depending on the deal that appears into the right part. For example, I do have something which is the texpress.ca and I don't have to pay a lot here. So you can go here into add to the basket and purchase your domain. Once you have purchased your domain, you can locate it into the upper side of your account and go for my products. Directly here into your products, you want to make sure that your domain now appears in them. So in this case, here is my domain purchased. Now that we have just selected the domain which you like to connect into WordPress, let's sign into WordPress. Now, if you want to have an actual domain directly connected into WordPress, you should go directly into WordPress.com. If you want to do this from the other for example, hosting provider for, I don't know, maybe Hostinga, you can choose Pantheon, whatever, you should do this using your actual new hoster provider. So you can choose whether of those. In this case, I'm gonna go directly here into WordPress.com. So now that we are here into WordPress, uh, what I wanted to do is to make sure that we have just administrated the necessary changes. So if you're using self-hosted WordPress site, I'm gonna go here into the provider of the dashboard, I have all my sites. I'm going to go into domains and here into domains what you want to do is to transfer a domain directly into WordPress. So here it's going to be asking you how do you like to unlock your domains, add domains and we can add a checkout. So here it's going to be asking you for a domain name. So here we you have an actual authorization code. So this is our unique code provider ownership needed for secure domain transfer between registers. So if I go here inside my GoDaddy, I'm going to copy it and I'm going to paste it directly here. Let's go back into GoDaddy. I located here the domain section. Into domain, here is my domain that I want to get started. I'm going to choose the manage DNS. Now we needed to add or edit several DNS records on GoDaddy to point your domain to the WordPress. So this typically includes A types, C name types, and so much more. So for A records, what you can do is just to type here, uh, add new record. And we have the C name records, select the type, and of course, add all the values. So to get the values, what you want to do is to go back into WordPress and I locate this site I would like to connect it. In this case, it should be the AI versus creator site. And I go here for actions and settings. Into settings, I want to locate the new site address. So I go for add custom address and I paste the domain that we currently have. So in this case, I choose I own this domain. So here, as you wanted to do is to choose to whether you wanted to transfer your domain or just connect the domain with the current provider at the point it to WordPress.com. So we can choose whatever you wanted to. In this case, I'm going to go here for select. And here, as you can see, we have the actual price of the order. So this order should be, let's say we're only paying for an actual subscription of the WordPress. Here, the domain connection. And lastly, the billing information. As you can see, the domain connection is free with the actual plan. And the purchase comes with a lot of elements, of course, come with WordPress. If you don't want to pay for this, then what you can do is to purchase your domain directly here into WordPress. But I can totally suggest you to do this uh, so you can do this in a very easy way. So once you have successfully done that, it's going to be giving you the actual information of the domain for connecting your uh, domain, which in this case should be a CNM account. I can go for transfer my actual URL domain, so this could be much more easier. I'm going to hit into unlock, unlock my domain. And here it's going to be giving us a domain authorization code where we can actually have a secret code where we can usually find this into my domain settings page. So the authorization code should be found directly inside your actual transfer. And here we have the advanced section. So I'm going to go here into transfer to another register. I hit now into continue. And here should be my authorization code. 
So I click on it. And here, of course, you should be seeing here blood because this is just for security reasons. I copy this into the dashboard. I go back directly here into WordPress and I paste my authorization code and I hit now into continue. Lastly, we have the checkout of the domain registration fee. As you can see, in order to continue, we needed to make sure that we actually have the WordPress Explorer. So you can remove this plan. And lastly, what you want to do is to make sure that you hit now to continue and your domain should be now appearing here directly into WordPress. So it's not unusual that you might need you guys to create an actual store to, to have an actual active plan directly into WordPress. Otherwise, it's not going to be available, of course, if you wanted to get started here into WordPress. But that is how we can actually make the connection between the GoDaddy and directly into your WordPress site. So guys, that is a really yeah, common and easy solution. Lastly, what you want to do is to just test your site by entering your new domain and you're actually good to go. And there you have it, guys. We have successfully connected GoDaddy domain directly here into WordPress. Now the custom domain, guys, could be helping you to make professional and trustworthy. If you find this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully, we'll see you next time.